Hello and welcome to creativenurse.co.uk Today I've just got a quick tip to share with you on how you can use Illustrator to create a watercolour text effect So we're going to head over to the type tool We're going to select the front of MyWord Pro or any font of your choice We're going to ensure that the font size is 111 and What we're simply going to do is just type in some text ensure that it's capitalised and in between each in between each letter, we're going to do a space. The space is A T I T A. I'm going to head to the selection tool. I'm just going to move it out so it's all onto the one line. And then we're going to go head over to Object, Expand, OK. And we're going to ensure that there's no fill added to the text and we're going to ensure that stroke 1 has been selected it hasn't quite done it there we go yep and then we're going to just add some more text that do the same thing again ensure it's capitalized and do a space in between each layer and then we're going to repeat the same process which we just done of Expand, okay. Ensure that there's no fill, and ensure that there's a stroke. Okay, so once that's done, we're going to head over to the brushes tab. Set the brushes tab. There should be a little drop-down menu to access the brushes library. And we're just going to head to select artistic brushes, and we're going to select artistic watercolor. And we'll drag this down a little bit. And the brush that we're looking for is watercolor stroke 4. So we're going to select that. And press the X to get rid of that little box. We're going to select all the text effects. All the text. And then we're going to click on watercolor stroke 4. And there we go. It's that simple. We've created a watercolor text effect using Illustrator. Hope this little quick tip is being useful and I hope you enjoy the outcome and can use it within your projects. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for further tutorials.